Here is the Prime Minister of Australia, the Right Honourable R.G. Menzies. Fellow Australians, it is my melancholy duty to inform you officially that in consequence of a persistence by Germany in her invasion of Poland, Great Britain has declared war upon her and that as a result, Australia is also at war. Dear sweetheart, Alan and Bruce, I suppose you have received cable to say we arrived safe and sound. We arrived at Singapore, but are now in Malaya. Can't tell you where though. Singapore is one of the prettiest places I've ever seen. Dear sweetheart, Alan and Bruce, I received your ever loving letter today and I'm pleased to hear that everyone is in the pink. I miss you all. That's the worst part of being so far away. Let's hope that time goes pretty quick. Dear sweetheart, Alan and Bruce, I received your ever loving letter today. Gee, it was good to get a letter from home and I'm pleased to hear that you are well and the rest of the family. Dear sweetheart, well, I'm still waiting for news. It is a long time now. The children are growing tall. Bruce, you would not know. And they are all talk of when you will come back. The great times we are going to have together. Have you got all of my letters? I sent two while I was at Bankstown. I'm getting another parcel ready and I'm trusting to luck that you will get it. Dear sweetheart, well, the time is getting long. I wonder just where you are tonight. Dear Gwen, I am a prisoner of war in Nippon. I am enjoying real good health and working every day except Sundays. In fact, I haven't lost a day's work since I've been here. Dear Gwen, it is by the great generosity and kindness of the Japanese government that I am allowed to write home to you. I hope this finds you and the children in good health and also the rest of the family. Dear Gwen, once again I am allowed to write to you. I hope this finds you well as it leaves me. I bet the two boys have grown and that I will not know them. I don't know how much longer this war is going to last, but I hope it's so much longer. I am just longing to see you all again. Won't that be such a great day? Dear sweetheart, Alan and Bruce, this is something that you have been waiting for and that I have been waiting to do for a long time. It must be getting on four years, honey, since we could sit down and write what we liked. Anyway, darling, those days are all over and done with. I am that excited that I can hardly hold this pencil. I don't know what to write about. Gosh, what a time we will have. How is my little girl and those two sons of mine getting on? They had my weight down to 7 stone 12 pounds. I was nearly left in Japan. The end of the war just came in time. But as I said before, these days are gone, but I don't think I will ever forget them. <laughs>